What's up, T people? Episode 500. Big 500. Oh. oh. <laughs> It was oh 5,000. I, I don't know. Oh, my. I think we're dead by the time we get there. Yeah. Either we're, like, in a nursing home, like the, the Irishman, and we're just, like, you know, sitting there. <laughs> I'm, I'm envisioning a more sci-fi future. Um, thanks for staying with us for, episode, for 500 yeah. episodes, everybody. Can't believe every one of you watched every single episode. Let me know which one you t- started tuning in on. Sure <laughs> like, episode 400 or 497 or, or yeah. if you... Uh, have been with us for the from the beginning. I'm, I'm curious if anyone has been with us since the beginning. I think I know of a couple. Um, okay. Yeah, and uh, and they're freaks. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to get too serious because it's TDB after all. But um, it has been a privilege to be doing this with you for this long. So cheers to that. Yeah, cheerio, cheerio. <laughs> Say it proper. Uh, um, and uh, chilio, and we got some dim sum yeah. here. This is from a uh, local shop, probably. The most popular one in Seattle yeah. International District, Jade Garden. Yeah, um, Debatably uh, the best. It's, not, it's probably not my personal favorite right. as far as like just the best, but the dim sum's fine in, in, in this tasting. Yeah. yeah. It's good. You can enjoy this. We're drinking some ripe. Um, what's the story on the ripe? Yeah, so this is some Golden Needle White Lotus from Dai. Uh, yeah, some very tippy ripe, so it should be a little like rich, but you know. When we're drinking tea in this way, uh, the the food is is the main thing, yeah. and the tea complements that. Totally. Yeah, and this is one of those cases where actually like a little bit of the digestive properties of tea, you know, I can kind of see it in this case. It's not a panacea. Are you um, talking about health benefits, bro? <laughs> I am talking about health benefits. Health benefits, bro. <laughs> yeah, the legendary episode. That's how you know this is the last one ever. <laughs> Just um, kidding, it's not the last one. <laughs> so what is this? That's is a taro cake? Yeah, pan fried uh, daikon cake. Cool, okay. I don't have half of one to start. Um, and yeah, you know, it's funny. I remember growing up to dim, going to dim sum in the summertime and walking up King, up the King's Bakery, up to the top floor, and this, just this blaring fan the whole time on that top floor to get the, all that heat out of there. And just packed, um, and uh, yeah, great memories. Dim sum is certainly, a, I think, you know, it seems, like, it seems feels to me like part of Seattle. Mm-hmm. Uh, but obviously, not everyone grows up like this. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, uh, you didn't live far from the international district growing mm-hmm. up too, so yeah, not really. Just a little jump over, but yeah, I mean, my family, it was one of the things that we would do as like a big extended family. So my big Chinese extended family would get like four tables at like a dim restaurant restaurant on a, a uh, on a weekend nice yeah just pack in there and uh go to town yeah totally and do you remember you know the tea was always secondary to the food like you said mm-hmm. um i don't think it was usually poor either i, I want to say it's like usually jasmine like some shitty jasmine or yeah some something shitty yeah um I think I've had Pure at, at uh, the, what was that one that we would go to, the, was it ABC, it was next to that ABC seafood place? Mm. I love that one. Purple something? Yeah, maybe. I, you and I, we'd go there a lot. Um, mm. So good. Mm. Fatty, starchy, some, some sweet flavors, umami. Dim sum is a... Perfect hangover brunch meal. You know, you were naughty and it's Sunday and you're all going out to dim sum. Yeah. Um, so, um, yeah, this is a real treat. I can't believe it. I've got episodes. That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> That's a lot. That's a lot. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. And we slowed down it. at some point because at one right. point it was really one a week. And then I think pandemic slowed mm. us down for a bit. So there's a couple of years where we were like... Three episodes or something, because we hit ten years before we hit uh, five hundred. Uh huh. Mm, but not by much. I mean, yeah, you can look back at the old episodes and see us age. Seriously, I had hair. <laughs> One negative of tea drinking loses your hair. hair. Yeah. Killed you. That's really good. Never had something like this before. Yeah, it's one of my go tos. Really savory. Yeah. Um, and then, uh, yeah, yeah, in Hong Kong, some of the places you can go. You get it, and they're just, like, frying it right there. You just go up and grab it right from them. Nice. So you get it, like, super fresh. That's fantastic. Well, 
tea is such a great thing to do with friends. It's um, just have to be the showcase of the experience if you're having a great time with your 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 people. Um, certainly, we do a really nerdy version of tea one on one, which I really love. But this is also a great way to do tea, mm -hmm. and certainly in my book this counts. So um, get out there and keep on drinking your drinking your drinks. Uh, and again, thank you everyone who has decided to watch any of this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How is the dim sum, Denny? The dim sum tastes really good. Yeah. Um, I loved it with the chili. Um, yeah, it's really tasty. I um, wonder how it'll impact our palates for more filming. We'll see. Um, <laughs> I find sometimes if I'm super full, I taste <laughs> things less well. Um, well, you know, tea will, can also make you hangry, and I can hear it too after today's couple episodes we filmed, we will not be hangry. <laughs> That's true. I mean, I will say that dim sum can be also a good post-tea session thing, mm. because like you, you drink it, right. you're like super hungry, and then you just go to town. Right. Valid. <clears throat> Mm. Perfect pairing, subtle but a lovely viscosity of ripe. Um, yeah, delicious. All right, uh, I think that's that's it. Yeah, I mean, we don't have too much more to say. We're just gonna go to town on this dim sum. Yeah, and we're not a dim sum review show, at least not not on this <laughs> not channel. Yet. Um, so thank you all for tuning in. We'll see you on five hundred one. Peace, deuces. <laughs>